Hello Aces and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how to build the Christmas Bullet, which is considered to be one of the worst airplane designs ever. Now with Christmas around the corner, as of recording this video, it is December 19th, 2023. Now Christmas is obviously like within a couple of days. However, this airplane's name has nothing to do with the holiday. It actually has to do with the guy who made the plane, who was named William Whitney Christmas. So, and let's just say this guy had no engineering background. He had no experience in building airplanes. He had no experience even how airplanes even worked. But yet he decided to build one anyway. And he came up with this. Now, this is a biplane because it has two wings on the upper and lower sections of the fuselage. However, there is a lot a lot of design flaws with this aircraft. Actually, there's not a lot of design flaws. There's actually just one major design flaw that um, that this plane has. I'm going to pan around this plane, um, and I'm going to give you a clue. It is not the shape of the fuselage, despite it looking really weird. It is not the fuselage that's the, the design flaw. I'm going to give you guys five seconds to write in the comments right now what do you think the design flaws are with this airplane what do you think what's wrong with it I'm gonna give you five seconds okay so I'm gonna tell you what's wrong with this plane so this is a biplane right biplanes if I is there any around here okay yes right here we got the Sopwith Camel let's just go to the Sopwith Camel here just for an example so you can see for the Sopwith Camel, I've already done a tutorial on this. Please go check it out. It's a pretty cool little tutorial if you want to build this really cool World War One fighter. Uh, but anyways, going back to my point. So this plane has something that holds the two wings together called struts, you know, like it holds the wing together so it doesn't rip off. Well, if we go back to the uh, Christmas bullet here. You can see that it lacks them so basically what happened was this plane was built it was test flown and this plane was supposed to appeal to the US Air Force so it um, so they did some testing so they wanted to test it just to see how it you know would work and everything to see if they would like it or not so they tested it this plane successfully took off it flew and then it crashed and then the pilot died so then, uh, I guess, uh, Mr. Christmas decided, I'm going to make another one. So he went ahead and made another one. Didn't really change much on the plane. He just built another version of the same one. And uh, so they did it again. They did another test. Flew it. It successfully, well, successfully took off. It flew. And then it crashed again. And uh, the pilot died again. And the issue was as soon as it took off, the wings just ripped right off the plane because there's nothing holding it together. Because the idea, I guess, for him was it to flap like a bird, but it didn't work. And, uh, yeah. So the wings just ripped off the plane, and the plane just crashed and killed the pilots. So, so in total, this plane's entire surface career, it had two takeoffs, two flights, zero landings, two crashes, and two deaths. So... Yeah, it is considered to be the worst airplane design ever, and this and this is why. And also just because of the the lack of knowledge that Christmas had to design an airplane. So, and um, another thing about this plane as well is that it was very um, like it, it, but it, its fuselage is a very weird shape. It's pretty ugly if you look at it. However. Um, the reason why this plane was called the bullet though, was because it was supposed to be very fast. That's what it was supposed to be, like a bullet, you know, a speeding bullet. So, but anyways, um, that's, that's all the information I have to tell you about this plane. Um, if you want to build the world's worst airplane ever designed, here's what you're going to need. You're going to need black wool, buttons, quartz slab, block of quartz, block of iron, fence gate, Quartz stairs, nether brick slab, oak fence, 
And if there's any other materials that I'm missing, I will be sure to, uh, to tell you. So in terms of the layers of this airplane, it is super easy. It's a really, really easy design. So, yeah. So anyways, here are some dimensions if you, in case you're interested. It is a 2 to 1 scale. It is 13 meters long, and that's from the propeller tip to the tip of the tail over there. Or actually, I think till, yeah, to the very end of the fuselage there with the tail. Actually, with the little tail wings coming out kind of thing. Uh, it is 18 meters wide, so from wingtip to wingtip, and 8 meters high. So, so yeah, anyways, with, that, with all that out of the way, let's begin this build. Okay, to get started, you're going to place one black block right here. Now you're going to skip three, one, two, three. Then you're going to place another one here. You're going to place some buttons on the sides of these. And then you grab your quartz slab. You're going to go one, two, three. And then you're going to place two blocks on each of these wheels. And then you're going to put upside down stairs just like this. And then you're going to put a slab in between here. And then you're going to build a set of three here with a one going out if I just check to make sure yep so one going out and then it's just gonna be one two three on the back so you're gonna make a little three by three box so it should look like this and then you're just gonna have a block of quartz on the bottom here and then you're going to have your little tail uh, stick off the back so now what you're going to do is you're gonna come out by one well, you're going to put one on here, and then you have two blocks like that, and then on, and then right on here, you're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it should just be one over, and it should be kind of one over, one past this slab here. The same thing on the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then right at the back, you are just going to have a upside down stair, just like that. So now what we're going to do is we're going to, oh yeah, and you can just fill in the middle. You just fill this in here. We're going to do the little uh, bottom wings here. So you're going to go one, two, three, four. So it's like one block back. So right here, you're going to skip, you're going to leave this one and one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. Like that. And then the same thing, you're going you're to skip one and go one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. Just like that. So that finishes the first layer. Oh, and actually you're just going to place two slabs in right just like this. So that finishes the first part. Now let's go on to the next part. Okay, for the next part, you are just going to basically, this part's really easy. You're just going to put one here of, of quartz. You're going to grab two black wool. And you're going to put some black there. And then you're just going to build this. And it's going to go around here like that. You do the same thing on the other side. Gonna put one here and then you're gonna have two black blocks and then you're just gonna build it like that no slabs and then you're gonna have your engine right here and we can place we could just might as well just build the propeller and the engine all that stuff so then you're just gonna put two blocks out like this and two blocks out like this and you and you're gonna place your fence gates now you, you now you can't place fence gates. If I delete this, you can't place fence gates uh, floating. So you have to place a block underneath them in order to place them. So there's um, so there's the uh, propeller and engine. So now you're just gonna put three across the top, and then this is gonna be another two like that, and then this will go down, and then it goes like this, and then it and then there's an upside down stair like that. So you can kind of see the really straight basic shape of this plane. So, and then you're going to do the same thing on the other side. You're just going to drag it down to here. Oh, and you're going to place two blocks in like this. So now what you're going to do is you're going to grab some black wood. You go one, two, and then you're going to place another brick right here. And then you're going to place quartz just like this. And then with your wings, you're going to go like that. And you're, but you're going to stop too short. And then you're going to stop too short like this. And then you're going to place your stairs like, like so. So basically what you're doing is you're placing a quartz block, nether brick, 
one, two, three, four, five blocks, a stair, and then you're just going to fill the back in like this, and it's going to go one out, just like that. And then you're going to go one, you're going to go two, one, and then this is going to be for your rudder here, and then you're going to place some uh, stairs going like this. And for the tail wings, we're just going to go one, two, three, and I actually think it's on the, uh, oh, there's actually an upside down stair here, okay. So right here on this part, there's going to be an upside down stair like this. And you're going to go one, two, three. And then one, one, two, three. And then you're just going to go one, two, like that. You're going to make it a two. And then you have a one just like that. So you're going to go one, two, three. And one like this. And I just want to see how the cockpit's laid out. Okay, so it's like where this two is. You're gonna have your seat there. So, so where this is here, you're going to place your cockpit floor like that, and then you're gonna just fill up the rest of that. And you're gonna place a seat. I used a uh, cobblestone seat like this, and I think it's one more. I don't think there's a lot of room in here. No, there is not. And I just placed a simple lever inside the plane like that. Now you also can place some item frames if you want, if you want to make your gauges, you can make your throttle and buttons and all that stuff. I'm going to leave that out uh, for now, maybe near the end I'll show you how to do that. But if you've done my other fighter plane tutorial tutorials, you'll kind of know like how I normally do them. So now we have finished the fuselage. Now we're just going to build the top wing and then we will be finished with the build. Okay, so for the wings, you are going to make a 3x3 three three box. So you're going to go 1, 2, 3, and then you're just basically gonna, going to cover up this part. And then you're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then you're just going to fill this up. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5. And you're going to do the same thing here. And then uh, the wings, because this thing has no struts on the ground, it, the wings kind of droop down a little bit. So you're going to go down by one. You're going to have one, two, three. And it's going to be a three by three like this. And then you're just going to place one slab here and one slab on the bottom there. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. You're going to go one, two, three. And then you're just going to have, you can fill that in three by three. And then you're just going to have a slab here and then a slab right here. So in case you did get a bit confused, I'm going to go over it with you. So you're going to have a three by three box and then you're going to go one, two, three, four, five. And then you're going to go come down by one and then have a three. So it's basically five and then three. And then you're just going to place a one and a one underneath that. And the only other thing I need to do right here you're just going to place in a black block right here now i suppose what you could also do too is you could probably place another brick here but i did not do that because the uh you can see the color change like you can see the white here just kind of looks a bit better kind of thing but uh, even though this plane's quite ugly really but uh, anyways that finishes the build so as you can see it was a very quick one Okay guys, that finishes this tutorial on the Christmas Bullets. So I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial on the worst airplane ever designed. If you did enjoy, please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And if you have any build requests of what you'd like to see next on the channel, please let me know down below in the comments. And I'll see you guys on the next one later.